Hi, this is Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And this is the question I got asked this morning. Teddy, how do I move a file from Google Drive to a memory stick? Before I show you how to do that, do me a favor and do yourself a favor. Hit that subscribe button because I have a whole lot more videos coming on how to use Google Workspace and Gmail. So if I go to my uh, uh, Google Workspace right now, you can see I have three files there. I, so if I go to Photos, you'll see that there's this photo there. And if I go back to My Drive, you'll see you know I have resume samples, another folder with resumes, you know test resumes in there as an under subfolder. So you know here's a, a couple here's a, a Word doc. Excuse me, here's a Google Drive document. Here's a PDF. But let's say I want to take that Google Drive document. Double click on that, you'll see. There it is, a Google Drive document, Google Docs. And so I love Google Docs. I use it all the time, but not everybody has Google Docs. So sometimes I have to take that file and export it out of Google Docs and make it available to others. And let me show you two ways that you can do this. First of all, I can do File, Download. So when I download it, I can download it as a Microsoft Word document, an ODT, I don't use that, an RTF, I don't really use that. I do use PDF every now and then. So let's say who I want to send it to, they need the ability to edit it. I would probably send it to them as a Microsoft Word document. Now this is if they don't use Google Docs. But if they don't need a need to edit it, they just need to see it, I would probably download it as a PDF. One of these two. This would be for editing. This would be only if they need to see it. So let's use the editing format. So let's say I click on Download Microsoft Word. Now I just downloaded it and I didn't tell it where to download it, but I know it goes into my download folder. So let me show you where it is. So I can click right here on this little arrow and I can say show in Finder. And on the Mac, it's going to show it up in the Finder. On a PC, it's going to show up in what's that called? Uh, you know, a Windows Explorer. So I'm going to click on that and here it is right here. So it's downloaded. It happens to be in my downloads folder. Now if I want to put this on a memory stick, on, on the Mac, and it's pretty much the same way on a PC. Here's my memory stick right down here. I've already plugged it into the USB port. If I click on that, you'll see I got one document in there. If I go to Downloads, I can just click on this document right here, a Word document, click and hang on to it, and I can drag and drop it on the memory stick. And there's that file on the memory stick, in this case on a Mac. And if I'm done doing that, I can click on this little arrow right here, and it basically ejects that memory stick and I can go over there and unplug it from my computer. Watch this. And by simply plugging it back in, there's the memory stick again. And again, there's the resume document that I downloaded. Now, one more thing to show you is in Google Drive, I can click on that file, go to the three dots and I can say download it it's going to by default convert to Word and again it's going to put it down in the in my in this case my downloads folders and then I'd follow the same steps to move it from my download folders on my computer to my memory stick. I'm Teddy Burris your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist trainer and coach hope this is helpful for you.